Today we're stopping by the uh, construction site for the Surfside Pier. Uh, have not been here since sometime in March. So probably gonna see quite a big difference between this video and the last. I can already see they have several pylons there around the area where the restaurant sat before. So we're gonna uh, walk through the parking lot here of the Surfside Beach Hotel and uh, walk out on the beach and get a closer look and possibly uh, get an aerial shot from the drone afterwards. So I'm gonna head on there. So the recording of this video is uh, May the 6th. And it's probably around 8.30 in the morning. And it's probably around 70 degrees, just a light breeze. I think it's gonna be a pretty nice day overall. made it out to the beach quite yet but see several pylons here that are being already been set i'm assuming the restaurant's being rebuilt right here whatever it is it's, it's gonna be pretty tall much more than it was if that's the case so if you didn't know you can park in the uh public parking back behind this resort you can kind of cut through here through their uh, crosswalk to get over the dune onto the beach So these are the uh, pylons for the pier, or the legs as some may call it. I'm not really sure the dimensions of them, but they are solid concrete it looks like. These are all the ones that have been set for, I believe a restaurant or the tackle shop or gift shop, whatever. And I think these are the first set of uh, the pier itself. I'm gonna walk up and get a little better angle to try and explain what my understanding of how this is gonna work is. So the the uh, metal structure here, in a sense, is gonna act as a ramp. And it hasn't been yet, but they will uh, backfill it full of sand. So the cranes and the skid loaders and their equipment can drive up on it. And uh, I think on the back side of it, right out here, just past it, they will start to uh, build temporary pier it'll go out into the water and they can ride on it and then the actual pier is going to run through here you can see the you can see the old piece is still in the water the actual pier will run right here along the side of it so if they're up on the ramp and on the temporary pier they can position the cranes and everything to where they can set the pylons down in the water and they have a way to continue to go out further in the water all the way to the end and then once the pier's done, they'll have to remove all of this. If you can tell by the angle, but these four pylons are to the left of the trestle. 
behind it and to the left. Not sure what these big concrete slabs are for. Guess we'll find that out later. That's kind of my thoughts on it. If I'm wrong, just leave a comment below and uh, correct me. Down here near the water now, and you can see the only pieces left from the old pier. This is the trestle. It's very, very tall. I'm not sure how tall, but. As a reminder, as I've done in other videos, if you want to see like live progress of what's going on, there's a webcam on top of this building right here. It stays up just about all the time. It's never been down any of the times that I've checked. And it's on the uh, Surfside Beach Hotel website.